I'm gonna show you one of my old trick. I explained it in one of my videos. I'm gonna link it above. In that video, I thought the only way if you use this trick protects your bunker by shield or by IC and you try to circle around it to protect your tanks. But this time I discover that some players recently they use desolators and some of them they use miners. I never thought that infantries and miners can save your tanks too by the same tactic. I see this trick all the time but I see a lot of people they don't know about it. It's very very simple if you want to eat your enemy's dog at choke point what are you gonna do build two dogs keep one of the dogs at that choke point far away from your enemy's dog and the second dog keep it close to that dog return it back so your enemy's dog want to eat it and then your stop dog gonna eat it you're gonna see it in the video it's very explainable i see this trick a lot of pros they use it in a free for all maps or you are playing with many players so what's happening is at the end of the game if you have oil and your enemy try to capture it and the ng get really close let the ng get really close and then quit the game and the oil gonna explode and kill his ng easy peasy lemon squeezy this is a very very annoying trick oh my god if someone uses it on me i'm gonna really really upset so what it is is very very simple at the beginning of the game a lot of pros they know every single map and they're gonna know which direction you're gonna build toward because they know that map so well so they're gonna put their dog on that particular place so they are not gonna let you build and they're gonna delay a lot it's very very annoying in certain maps this is a very common sense but a lot of people they don't know this trick what are you gonna do if there is two friends cannon and there's distance between them and you want to kill one of these friends cannon what are you gonna do make your tanks get really close to the friends cannon so the other one is gonna hit the first one and you're gonna destroy it this is a very very basic trick everybody knows it but a lot of people they don't know it this is a new combination i never see it in my life if you try to load your iov with desolators and even bomb to any factories you want but i don't know why this this one is really struck my attention so much because i see this really really effective because Ivan bomb is gonna go and directly install his bomb to that particular factory and when the tanks get really close to want to kill that Ivan bomb the desolator gonna deploy i never see something like this there's a new trick for all pros try to discover it use it maybe there is something new about it i don't know experiment with it if you are a 1v1 against chronosphere i mean the enemy has nothing he has only chronosphere and you have some tanks to destroy his power or or the chronosphere i saw some players they stick their tanks together so he gonna chrono it to see to other units as far away from his base or to enemy's base so what i advise you if you want to attack any factories and he's ready to use the chronosphere use x after you hit the factory and your tank gonna keep hitting and they're gonna keep spreading at the same time this is a very rare trick but i see it is very beneficial at these particular cases this is a very very annoying trick i see it only in big games in games where you build massive amount of units if you have a lot of units and you're scared all the time from super weapon and you want to destroy his super weapon but he protected a lot what are you gonna do drive some of your units and try to attack him far away from his super weapons so he said oh my god he's now want to attack me so all his units he want to go and attack your units so at that time his super weapons is exposed so if you prepared a lot of chrono legendary or a lot of jets you can easily attack his super weapon this is a very very basic pro technique i see only pro players use it so for example if you are 1v1 against batter fortress what are you gonna do basically you want to drone it because that's the easiest and simplest way to kill it so what are you gonna do firstly you point out your tanks to get close to that battle fortress and what are you gonna do when the tank get really close you try to drone it very simple and the drone gonna get inside it because tank get all the heavy shots it's a very very simple technique but i see a lot of people they don't use it 
This is a very common glitch, I see it all the time. For example, if even bomb, install a bomb on any of your factory, a lot of people, what are they gonna do? They gonna build an engineer and they try to defuse this bomb. But the problem is, sometimes this trick doesn't work. If the factory is a little bit damaged, the engineer will not gonna defuse the bomb. The engineer will gonna repair the factory and the bomb will gonna still there and the factory gonna be explode. Be prepared. If you use this trick, always keep in mind the factory is a full percentage of health. Because if there is a single drop of health, the engineer will not gonna defuse the bomb. Keep this trick in mind.